Hey you guys, welcome back to another adventure of Coffee Girl Gaming. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? I think you're ready for it. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. All right, you guys. So again, welcome back to another adventure. And today we are doing Villager Maze Episode 2. So today we have a bunch of villagers in our maze. Same maze we used before, but we added a few more things to it. So for example, this flag pole right here, if one of the villagers, you know, might get a little sidetracked, maybe he'll come and play, he or she will come and play with the flag. And right there, that'll prevent them from leaving the maze so that maybe, hopefully, we won't have an incident like last time where Fauna went storming out of the maze as quick as can be and the maze was over in like five seconds. So we want this one to last a little bit longer than last time. Unfortunately, Fauna's not in this one, um, but we do have a lot of other villagers that are ready and willing to go. So let's go ahead and go over here and see who's playing today. All right, you guys, so all the villagers are gathered up behind me here, as you can see. And so just to go down the list of what we're hunting for today, if Raymond wins, we're hunting for penguins. If Bonbon bon wins, we're going to be going for wolves. If Poppy wins, we're going for pigs. If Puddles wins, we're going for hippos. And if Rosie wins, we're going for goats. So um, we couldn't get a lot of villagers today because unfortunately there's a birthday party going on on the island today. So Fauna, happy birthday. Um, so a lot of the villagers are over her house celebrating and they didn't want to take part in the, the whole contest today on, on villager hunts. So um, we did stop by, we gave her her present, we celebrated, you know, the usual birthday stuff. But, um, yeah, that's why we only were able to get five contestants today. So, let's go ahead and I'm, I'm ready to start the maze. Are you guys ready to start the maze? Let's do this. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and move out of their way and we'll see who's out the gate first and who decides to go to the exit. Bon Bon's like, what is that statue? Seems like Bon Bon's a really, really smart villager because I swear every single time she's in a contest or every time I do something with her, she's usually one of the first ones. Oh, I think she sees the microphone. Yep. She got tricked. But could you imagine if it was a singing contest? Bon Bon would have like totally kicked that one's butt. Let's see what Puddles is going to do. Up, oh, she's like, I see a shell. I'm gonna play with it. Gosh, those would have been really quick contests if we were doing a singing and a turtle shell contest. How many are you rooting? F How many of you out there are rooting for puddles to win? That would be hippos. Is she gonna pull a fauna? No, she didn't. I cannot believe that Puddles is going to win this fast. She's almost as fast as Fauna. Actually, she might even be faster. <laughs> All right. Well, we have a winner. So Puddles is going to be hippo. So I know a lot of people have been asking for a hippo hunt. So guess what, people? We are going on a hippo hunt. All right, you guys, so we're here in the maze still. Everybody's still just kind of hanging out. The only one that left is Puddles. They're all just kind of having fun, playing guitar, jumping on the haystack, all kinds of fun things. And they're like, we're not leaving here. We're happy here. Um, so, I mean, fine. They can play around in the maze if they want. That's what it's here for, right? For them for them to have fun. But um, in the meantime, I do want to go through the list of villagers that we're going to be looking for today. So... Down the list of hippos, we have Bertha, Biff, Biddy, Bubbles, Harry, Hippo, and Rocco. So 
it's really it's really not a very big list of hippos there's only seven hippos and that's that in itself is really scary um because that's not very many but we see hippos all the time sometimes numerous times in hunts so based on statistics and what we've gone through before it shouldn't be a long villager hunt right right okay i think you guys agree with me but let's go ahead and meet up at the Dodo Airport, take our little flight to our first island and see exactly who we get. Let's go do this. All right, you guys, so welcome to island number one. So I'm, I, you know, before doing all these villager hunts and talking to all you guys, I would have never put hippos as something that I would actually look forward to getting. But you guys have like totally swayed me. You switched my whole thought process on villagers that I would have normally went like, I mean, like Judy, Judy's my, my absolute dreamy. Those are the kinds I like. And to be honest with you, my island's absolutely full with little cuties like that. But I love the chance of getting to know all the villagers, which is why we do so many villager hunts. And I know, I know I've had a lot of people ask me about that in the comments. You know, why do you keep doing so many villager hunts? It's fun and I get to meet so many villagers and I love it. But and these are villagers I would have never had before. But um, I mean, Bertha, she's absolutely adorable. I've seen her so many times. Um, Biff, he has a whole like fan club after him and he's a jock. I mean, I would have never, ever, ever thought of going after a jock before, but I've heard so many great things about Biff, and his saying is squirt. I mean, how cute is that? But um, Biddy, oh my gosh, Biddy's always trying to get on our island. I will go on so many hunts, and she's just always there, and she's like, take me to your island, please, just take me. And I'm like, Biddy, I can't. I'm not searching for a hippo. But today, Biddy, you're on our list. And, um... Uh, Bubbles. Bubbles is on the list too, but she's peppy and we have so many peppy villagers. So I'm kind of wanting to steer clear of peppy right now, even though that's always my go-to category. Um, I'm actually looking for Harry and Rocco today because those are cranky villagers and we have no cranky villagers. And I mean, they just bring a whole nother aspect to the whole island and I want to meet them. So yeah. And then the only one left is, is Hippo and I heard that he has a really awesome house, which is kind of cool. I'd like to see it, but he is smug and we do have a couple of smug villagers on our island already. So again, I, I would love to mix it up and do something different, but we will see who we get. So let's go ahead and see who's on this first island here. Let's go. Oh, it's Zucker. <laughs> Oh, Zucker, I almost put Octopus on the list and you would have been on the very first island. Why are why are Octopus so scary? There's only three of them and I see them constantly and I would love to have Zucker on my island because he's so adorable. But um, Zucker, I'm not hunting for you today, so I'm sorry, but I, I, I love you. I would love to have you come to my island, but I will someday, someday come looking for you. You, Marina, and, and Octavian, so just look for me then. All right, you guys, so welcome to island number two. I'm, is it weird that I'm thinking of Judy? <laughs> I just, I really want her. But um, for some reason, I just have a feeling about her today. But you never know, you never know. So let's go see who's on this island. Let's go. Hey, cat. Are we on a cat hunt? I thought we were, right? We were looking for a cat, right? All right, I guess it's a hippo. But you know what, cat? I would love to have you on my island. So someday, maybe someday, we'll get to see who you are and what what your personality is like. Next island. All right, you guys, island number three, and it's Pear Island. Did last did the last uh, villager hunt break the pear curse? Did it? Should we see? Let's go see who's on this island. Let's go. Up, it's a koala bear. Gonzo. Gonzo, you're kind of cute. You know what? We didn't have koala bears on our list today, so we'll have to get them on there again soon. Cause I know there's a lot of koala bear lovers out there. 
But, um, Gonzo, yeah, you're, you're cute. I'm sorry that we're not coming to get you. Um, so on to the next island. Nice to meet you. Alright you guys, so island number four. So just in case you were wondering who we lost on our island, it was actually Mint. Um, I know, I know. I love Mint, but um, I mean, she wanted to go. So she came up to me and said she wanted to go, and I let her, but um, I have a feeling we'll see Min again. For some reason, I don't think this is the last time we've seen her, because um, she's just such a little adorable cutie squirrel, and I mean, we still have Marshall, so we still have another squirrel on the island, because you guys know how I love my little squirrely squirrels, but I did let her go. Um, so let's go ahead and see who's on this island and wish me lots of luck. Let's go. Well, you guys know this is um, <laughs> not one, it's not a villager I usually like to talk to. And why is that? His butt! Oh my gosh, look at his butt. And I apologize again for being inappropriate, but why? Why does he have the marks on his butt? Okay, I'm going. We're leaving. Let's go. All right, you guys, so island number five. So I have a question for all you people out there who have puddles. Is she usually that great of a competitor? I mean, she's brand new to our island. I've never seen her compete before, and oh my gosh, was she awesome. She like, you know, she's like, let me just go play with the shell over here, and you know, I'm out of here. I'm done. And then she just went straight to the beach and was walking around like, yep, I won. She just thinks she's so cool. But you got to love her for it because she's just so adorable. But, yeah, I just, I had no idea she had it in her. Well, let's go see who's on this island. Oh, it is Frida. <laughs> so, Frida, you always make me hungry. I want a hot dog. But, um, it was nice seeing you. I don't know if she's supposed to represent a hot dog or a hamburger. What do you think? Um, but let's go ahead and go to the next island. And it was super awesome to see you again. Oh. It's Bangle. Bangle says, I want to come back to your island. Please take me back. And Bangle, you know I love you, but you wanted to leave, silly. So, <laughs> so I let you go, but I'm glad to see that you're still doing good. And maybe one day we'll have you back on your island. I mean, I have had her twice on my island, so. Um, but let's go ahead and go and see who we find next. And I don't know if you noticed, but Pear Island has not been so bad lately. I mean, it's had some pretty cute villagers. So let's go. All right, so we're on island number seven. We're going a lot longer than I anticipated. I was so afraid we were only gonna use one ticket, but you know, the hippos are proving me wrong, but it's falling in line with our standard villager hunt where when we're searching for something, they just don't show up. So. Let's go see who's on this island and wish me lots of luck. Oh, we found an elephant. It's Sid. Hey, Sid. No, you're not a hippo. But it's super nice to see you again. And um, steer me in the right direction. Which way is hippos? You know? Hmm. I don't think he knows. Okay. Well, we'll see you later. Wilbur, do you know which way hippos are? Point. Come on. You know you can point with your wing. Just do it. You see that look he just gave me? He was like, I'm not even paying attention to you right now. All right, next island. Who are you, Chicky? Becky. Well, Becky, you are a pretty awesome color. I love the purple. I have never, ever, ever met you before, as far as I know. Um, <laughs> I don't think I did. I don't remember meeting you anyway. But, um... It was super awesome to meet you, and I will see you on another island, probably. Alright, you guys, so island number nine. This is my lucky number. So maybe we'll be lucky enough to get an awesome hippo today. 
Um, I'm curious who you guys are rooting for. What hippo would you want on your island? Or what hippos do you have on your island? Um, I don't really know much about them. Because I've never really had them before. Um, but just let me know your feelings and thoughts. Um, I'm going to go see who's on this island. Let's go. We have an eagle. Let's see. Avery. Avery, you're pretty cool looking for an eagle. I've never, ever, ever wanted an eagle. With you think I'd really want them, but yeah. Um, I'm sorry, dude, but um, Avery, we are going on to the next island. So it's nice meeting you. Whoop, it's a froggy. Jambet, I'm assuming. Um, it's nice to meet you. I, I can't see your face. I can see it's, it looks like you kind of have some big lips there, but, um, let's wait until she turns around and we'll see what she looks like. Come on, girl. There she is. Well, not my favorite frog. We'll just say that. I totally would rather have puddles. <laughs> but let's go ahead and go on to the next island and again, wish me luck. Hey Olaf, um, I know somebody who had you and she liked you because of the name. She likes Frozen, so she likes Olaf. But other than that, I don't know if she was a big fan of you other than that. <laughs> but, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go on to the next island, but it was nice seeing you again. Yeah. Hey Nen, I am not looking for a goat today, but um, it's super nice to see you. Yeah, I don't know if we've ever actually seen her before, but um, we will see you again, I'm sure. She has a little dress like Felicity's. Where are you, villager? There you are. Hey, Mallory, we've seen you before. She is really cute. When I first saw her, I thought she was like really mad, but it's just the way her, her eyes are with her makeup, and she's adorable, actually. Um, so, too bad we weren't going on a duck hunt today. But, um, Mallory, we will see you some other time. Alright, Island 14. I'm kind of feeling this one. It could be it, right? Number 14. I'm sure it's a good number for somebody out there. So, let's go ahead and see who's on this island. Let's go. Looks like Dizzy. Hey Dizzy, I know you're just such a little cutie. Don't you just want to squeeze his little cheeks? He just looks so cute. But um, if only we were taking you home with us today. Um, but we'll, we'll probably see you again. And I hope that you have a wonderful day. Oh. Oh, it's Daisy. I've had Daisy before. She's just such a little cutie. Her personality is so sweet. Kind of like Fauna. But, um, yeah, she's a little sweetheart. Um, I don't know if we'll ever be hunting for dogs anytime soon. Maybe if we were searching for her personality type, would we get her anytime soon? Just because we have Maddie and Bones, and I love them so much. But, um... Daisy, it was super, super awesome seeing you again. You gotta love her little purple spots on her. She's just adorable. All right, you guys, on to the next island. All right, you guys, island 16. Who would have thunk, right? Who would have? I mean, how often do we run into a hippo on a normal villager hunt? We probably run into like five of them by now, sometimes back to back. And Biddy, Biddy is always there like, hey, take me, take me to your island. And Biff is always like, what up, little squirt? So, you know, I'm like in shock right now. It's like the elephant hunt all over again. So let's go ahead and see who's on this island. We will keep looking until we find them. <gasps> Oh, there we go. Chick, chick. It's Benedict. So is this like the island or the the chicken theme today? Are we going to see a bunch of different chickens and eagles? Maybe it's like birds because we've seen ducks. We've seen eagles. We've seen chickens. Um, so we've seen a lot of that category, even though there's three different ones mixed in there. But um, next island.
All right, you guys, Island 17, Bamboo Island. Bamboo Island won't do us wrong, right? They love us. They'll give us a, they'll give us a hippo, right? Let's go check it out and see who's on this one. Oh, it's Agnes. Too bad we weren't doing a piggy hunt. I would have gotten Agnes again, and I love her. She's such a little doll. If you guys ever see Agnes and you're not sure about her, get her. Because her personality is totally cute, and I love her. And look at her. She's just adorable. So, um, Agnes, I'm sorry we're not taking you today, honey, but um, I will see you again. Maybe when we're doing a piggy hunt. All right, you guys, so Island 18. I am, I, I, I'm like at a loss for words right now. I'm just in such shock that we have not seen a hippo yet. Um, so have you guys ever gone on a hippo hunt before and you're looking for this specific hippo and it took you like a million tickets? I'm just curious, am I the only one that this happens to? Do you ever go on a hunt and you're just hunting and searching forever and you just cannot find them? Because I swear, every time I'm looking for a specific villager, it's going to take at least 20 tickets. Um, which I know the peppy ones were only four, so we totally lucked out on that one. But when I saw hippos, I was like, all right, I'm going to get extra time tonight. I'm going to get to do this, this, and this. And I was planning my night. And now I'm like, oh my gosh, everything I just planned for is totally out the door. So... Let's go see who's on this list or on this island and wish me lots of luck. Hey Antonio, I swear you always pop up. <laughs> so I wasn't really looking for you. I was looking for a hippo. Have you seen one around here? Can you point one out to me? Do you think you might know where one might be? No? Okay. Well, I will see you later. I'm sure I will see you in the future. All right, you guys, so Island 19. Um, yeah, <laughs> again, I'm still at a loss for words. Um, it has to be this island, right? I mean, they can't be, it, we can't reach Island 20. I mean, come on, it's a hippo. There are so many times that we see him. I know there's only seven, but come on. <laughs> so, um, let's go see who's on this island and yeah. No. No. Ugh. Bunny, why couldn't you be on the last villager hunt? You know how bad I want you. Grr. She's like the equivalent of Felicity, but bunny style. I mean, come on. Look at her cuteness. Gosh, I really wanted her. I don't know if I've ever actually met Bunny before, but she is on my dreamy list. And look. How adorable she is. Could you imagine her and Bon Bon together? They'd be like total cuties. They'd be like besties. Oh, and by the way, Bon Bon and Rosie are besties now. They were talking today about what best friends they are and how much they are alike. So I was loving it. And um, yeah, they're, they're super happy on the island. But Bunny would have been an awesome, awesome addition to our island. And... Unfortunately, we're going to have to keep going because she's not a hippo. Or unless you guys think she looks like a hippo. Do you think? All right. Let's go. But Bunny, such a pleasure. Such a pleasure. Yep. Is it Olaf? Olaf, what are you doing here again? Oh, my goodness. Olaf, you really want to come to our island, don't you? Yeah, you do. Look at that little dance. All right, well, I'm sorry, dude, but we are totally not going to invite you. You do not even look like a hippo. So we will see you later. Where are you? Oh, is it Pango? It's Pango! <laughs> I haven't seen you in so long, my little bestie. Hey, Pango. Is it Anteater slash Bird Night? Um, yeah, that was funny, right? Um, but, oh, I miss you, girl. I didn't think I would miss you that much. Yeah, I'm feeling the love too. But no, we are not inviting you to our island. I wish we were, but um, good luck relaxing and, and we will see you another time. Yeah. Sorry, girl. Hippo, where are you? <gasps> it's Flurry. Flurry is such a little cutie. Can we get any cuter villagers tonight? I mean, 
Look at her. She's so cute. Aww, little flurry. All right, well, we're off to the next island, but it was super, super awesome meeting you and your little cute face. It is another eagle. Hey, Frank. I have definitely never met you before. You are very unique. Um, he's like a sporty parrot eagle kind of bird. All right, Frank, it's it's nice to see you. <laughs> nice to meet you. Gotta go. Wow, you guys, this is beginning to be a tough villager hunt. So we're on number 25. Whoa. <laughs> um, who would have thought? Um, any any thoughts on, on how many you think it's going to be? I don't know. I'm like flabbergasted right now. It's almost been two hours since we started this villager hunt. But um, let me go ahead and see who's on this island. All right, chief. Well, it is nice to meet you. So I think... No, we, I was thinking maybe we would have gotten every single um, <laughs> type of villager on the list, but we still haven't seen a penguin yet. Once we see a penguin, we will have seen everything on the list except for hippos, which is just craziness. All right. Um, well, on to the next island, and um, Chief, it's nice to see you. Oh, no. It's Frida again. Frida, I'm not going to talk to you, girl, but... Um, it's nice to see you. I'm sorry you guys didn't get to see her, but there she is. It's Frida. All right, we're off to the next island. All right, so Cyrano, we are not going to be inviting you today. Um, but <laughs> hopefully, hopefully we will find a villager within the next two tickets. Or three tickets. We have three tickets left. All right, let's go. Okay, so island number 28. And for all those anteater lovers out there, I hope that this video <laughs> is satisfying you today because, oh my gosh, we've seen so many anteaters and so many eagles and birds and, well, not birds, but you know what I mean. And um, I just hope that everybody out there who loves all those types of villagers is enjoying this episode. <laughs> but, um, we've also seen some awesome cute ones too. So, um, let's go ahead and see who's on this island. Well, Egbert, um, oh my gosh, it is not happening. It's not. Okay, so I'm off to the next island. Oh, it's Fuchsia. Oh, I miss you, girly. What's up with seeing all of our old villagers all of a sudden? They want to come back to us. That's what it is. Fuchsia's like, I miss you so much, girl. And you know, you don't have any sisterly villagers on your island, so you know you want me to come back. And I'm like, Fuchsia, if I was on a deer hunt, I would totally take you back. But I'm not on a deer hunt. So, um, dude, in the future, if I see you, I will take you again. But I'm sorry, honey. I gotta go. There hasn't been as much fights. I mean, Fauna hasn't been getting in any fights since she left. So I don't think her and Fauna got along that well. But it was so weird because I went to go talk to Fauna after Fuchsia left. And Fauna just started bawling. She was so sad that Fuchsia left. So I had no idea they liked each other that much. But um, on to the next island. All right, you guys. Island... 30, three, zero. What is going on here? I swear the Animal Crossing gods are totally against me on villager hunts. But let's go ahead and see if we can find a hippo on this one. They have to be on this island. They have to. Let's go. Money Island. I don't know if I've ever seen a hippo on Money Island. No, no. Yeah, we have. We have. All right, let's go and see who it is. <gasps> Cleo! No! Don't look at me like that. Don't give me those little eyes. Where were you when I was on my last pony hunt? I would have totally loved you. Not that I don't like Poppy, but um... Gosh, she's so cute. Alright, Cleo. I'm gonna leave you here. Next time we're on a pony hunt, I'm looking for you. You got it? Or, if we're looking for your category, like your personality. But, um, 
on to the next island. I have to get more Nook Mile tickets because that was all my 30 tickets. So I'll be back. All right, so island number 31, and come on, Pear Island, please, please be my saving grace. Come on, let's go see who's on this island. Look, why do they all have butts? I just don't, I mean, I guess gorillas have butts normally like that, but it's just so weird. Louie, all right, Louie, I don't know if I'm ever gonna want a gorilla on my island. I don't remember Rocket having a butt like that. It's just, it's, yeah, I just, it's not somebody I want on my island. <laughs> just kidding. But, oh, on to the next island. On to number 32. Well, island 32. We're trying to think positive here. We're trying. Anything positive you have to say about 32 tickets? I mean, any any great outcomes that you guys might have had with 32 tickets? But, um, let's go see who's on my island with 32 tickets. Money Island again. Let's go check it out. Where are you, villager? They ran away. Oh, it's a penguin. Aurora. So now we have officially seen everything on our list for the villager hunt except for hippopotamus. How long will it take for us to get a hippo? We will never know. I'm just going to take a penguin. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, Aurora. It was nice meeting you. I will see you again soon, probably. All right. Who feels that... 33 islands is a little bit excessive for a hippo hunt. <laughs> um, me, I do, I do, I do. Let me raise my hand here. Ooh, or I'm in shock. I'm in shock. That's what it is. <laughs> so, let's go see who's on this island. Well, it's definitely not a hippo. It's a bull. All right. Well, Coach, I've actually... Have I had Coach on an island before? I think I know somebody who had Coach. Um, but yeah, no, not gonna happen. Um, so on to the next island. Money Island. Come on, Money Island, do me something good today. Give me someone good. Oh, it's Cranston. Cranston, I am so sorry, dude. We are not looking for an ostrich, but, um, nice to meet ya. Pretty cool looking ostrich. So, um, this is island number 35, and in my head, every single time I'm on, my way, I'm on my way to another island, I'm like, this has to be it, right? And I keep thinking, you know what, I'm going to go do this real quick. I'm going to go grab another, <laughs> I'm going to go grab a cup of coffee. Maybe it's time to get my refill. And then I'm like, no, it's going to be this island. I'll just wait. But now it's number 35, so maybe I'll go get a cup of coffee after this island. <laughs> so, um, wish me luck and let's go. Please be this island. It is a lion. Who are you, lion? Bud. All right, bud. Because you're here, I'm going to go grab myself a cup of coffee. So in a moment when I return, I will probably be a lot peppier than I am now. So I will see you guys in just a moment. Alright you guys, so island 36, oh my goodness, what is going on here? Um, so as you can tell, I have my coffee, I've only taken a few sips though, but it's starting to work, starting. Um, so let's go ahead and see who's on this island and hopefully this will be the island. Ga gala, um, so I guess it's pronounced gala. <laughs> I'm going to go with Gala. Um, so you are totally adorable. Oh my gosh, look at the little flowers on her head. But um, we are totally not going to be taking you today, but you are too cute. All right, Island 37. I'm really, really, really hoping this is the island. It can be the island. Come on, you guys, let's do this. 
Hamlet. Well, it's been a while since I've seen you. But you're so adorable. You're always adorable. And I just love how cute he is. I just want to just give him a little... I just want to pick him up and hug him. <laughs> so, um, I've always loved Hamlet. But, um, alright. On to the next island. Okay. We are officially on number 38. What? Really? Am I, like, counting wrong? I mean, did I miss something? Did I not get the memo that hippos were on vacation? Um, I'm, like, I'm, like, in shock right now. <laughs> but, again, there's only seven of them. So, I mean, it, it's much a slimmer of a category than other villagers. But still, like, oh, my gosh, they pop up so much. And I swear, we should have just gone on a hippo hunt a different day. But, um, let's go see who's on this island. It's another piggy. Who is this pig? Chops. That's kind of a mean name for a pig. Alright, well, Chops, it's nice to meet you. I am off to the next adventure. Look at his golden locks. Is he supposed to be like a prince or something? Alright, we're out of here. Alright, villager, where are you? Oh, it's Dom. Oh my gosh. I know all you sheep lover out there are like, Take him! Take Dom! He's awesome! But, <laughs> oh my gosh, Dom is not a hippopotamus. So, oh my gosh, Dom is so cute. So, so cute. Look at that little face. Look at the little smile there. I've never had Dom. I know somebody who had Dom before, and they didn't know who Dom was when they first got him. It was on their very first island. And then, um... All of a sudden, they started seeing all the different little things that Dom did and how funny he was. And they were like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I got him. But, um, yeah, I, I, yeah, we just, he's not a hippopotamus. I'm sorry, y'all, you sheep lover out there, because he is totally cute. But, um, we are off to number 40. Money Island, come on, be good, be someone good. Please. It's Tipper. <laughs> Tipper, have you seen any hippos out here? None? Alright, well, I'm off to number 41. I will see you later. Hey, Audie. You are on our old villager hunt. Yeah, you're a little peppy one. And you're totally cute. So, um, I'm sorry that we're not going to invite you back to our island. But it was super nice meeting you. Alright, 42. This is that island that I said earlier that I feel a little something special about the island. Hopefully I was right, and right now we're going to find a villager. So let's go. Well, 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 what do we have here? It looks like we have Biff. And Biff, I am going to welcome you to my island. It's been a long time coming, and I just have to tell you that we've had comments from West Does Nothing because they have been rooting for Biff to come to my island for so long and they're one of my OG subscribers and I just this one's for you <laughs> so we are officially inviting Biff to our island so you have your request come true all right Biff so would you like to come to my island and join all of our other little villager friends they're really adorable and i know you're gonna love them it took me 42 tickets to get you today biff so please please come to my island and i will i will be so grateful yeah um and there's his little saying with squirt but um well said yes and then you're gonna go and you're going to talk to tom nook and we are gonna have a party let me tell you 42 ticket party right there but yeah <laughs> well i cannot tell a lie i was actually hoping for biff but there's there's a few other hippos i was hoping for too but um because again there's only seven so it's not like there's that great of a variety but we have no jocks on our island so i'm hoping biff lives up to my expectations because i was really looking forward to having him 
Um, supposedly, from what I've heard, his personality is just adorable. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and, and we're going to be having a lot more things happen in the future. Um, I'm going to be doing a Nookazon video soon, um, within the next few days. And I'm going to be contacting one of you guys or maybe a couple of you guys to do the, the donation bag. So give me your shout outs again. Let me know who wants to be involved in that. And then we'll choose a couple people to, to be involved in the Nookazon bags. But um, otherwise, I love you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification button. And on to the next adventure. You guys have a great day.